report, U.S. spies caught in anti-Trump plot, this is horrifying, by Mark Pervulovic for Christian News Alerts. It appears that some members of U.S. intelligence agencies acted to undermine the authority and respect of the president to other national spy agencies. In January, American intelligence agencies warned their contemporaries in the Mossad, Israel, Israel's foreign intelligence agency, said they believed Russia had leverage, quote, over President Donald Trump, according to The Hill. Various members of Israel's intelligence agencies, including its Mossad, attended a meeting in Langley, Virginia, shortly before Mr. Trump's inauguration in January. The meeting remained relatively uneventful until one top American intelligence official said that he thought Russian President Vladimir Putin had leverage over his new American president. The American official warned Israel to be careful once Mr. Trump entered office, warning that he thought sensitive information might end up getting leaked to the Russians in the future. This occurred in the same week that President Trump fired FBI Director James Comey, who was overseeing an investigation into alleged Russian interference in the 2016 presidential election. Reports say that President Trump referred to Mr. Comey as a, quote, nut job. Earlier in the year, it was revealed that the former FBI director was already drafting an exoneration letter concerning presidential candidate Hillary Clinton well before he interviewed many key witnesses pertaining to the private email server scandal. It was this revelation, among other suspicions, that cast doubt on the former FBI director's impartiality and justified, in some people's eyes, the decision that Donald Trump made to fire Comey from his position. This warning to Israeli intelligence officials precipitated a minor controversy when President Trump disclosed to Russian foreign minister Sergei Lavrov, information concerning ISIS's plan to create new laptop bombs and smuggle them on commercial planes, details that were uncovered from a covert Israeli operation, according to The Independent. The operation, which had two helicopters flying a team of commandos and Mossad operatives into Syria to gain information on this uh, newly reported weapon was shared with the United States with the assumption it would be kept secret. We have an arrangement with America which is unique in the world of intelligence sharing, said one intelligence officers, uh, officer as reported by The Hill. We do not have this relationship with any other country. To know that this intelligence is shared with others without our prior knowledge that is, for us, our worst fears confirmed, he added. However, American intelligence experts denied that the president had done anything wrong, adding that Mr. Trump did not share anything about the methods or source of information, that those details were not compromising in nature. I was in the room. It didn't happen, said Lieutenant General H.R. McMaster. Mr. Trump's national security advisor. At no time, at no time, were intelligence sources or methods discussed, and the president did not disclose any military operations that were not already publicly known, he added. The notion that the Kremlin had sensitive information on Donald Trump first emerged from Christopher Steele's dossier, a former intelligence operative himself. Mr. Steele was commissioned to write a report that amounted to a series of unverified accusations on behalf of a Clinton-funded political research firm, Fusion GPS. It's shocking to see some of our own intelligence officials turning their backs on the president and spreading these unverified conclusions behind his back. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below, and again, thank you so much for watching.